All right, what's going on guys? It's Zero here. So basically I wanted to talk to you guys today about Johnny Cage's Fatal Blow and why I personally think it's the best Fatal Blow in the game. Now the downfall of this is that he has to be around like 29% or a little bit less in order for this to actually work. But in tough situations, he can risk some health just to get out of the corner for free he doesn't even need to use his two defensive bars to get out of you know any kind of pressure any type of oki or whatever the case may be he can literally get out for free now the thing is, is that you're gonna have to keep practicing this in order for you to be able to constantly do this it's kind of difficult to do uh i'm still training and trying to uh manage to perfect it but i'm pretty sure this is going to be nerfed because technically no character in the game is supposed to have um any type of armor technically to where they can just easily get out of pressure or through gaps as if we were playing mkx all over again but when it comes to johnny cage and his fatal blow that's not the case i can actually get out of jax's uh gap which is his four three three into his uh one plus three string and i can get out of it for free um if he knocks me on the ground in the corner i can still get up and get out of it for free um, so I'm gonna try to show an example of that real quick So yeah guys, um, basically that's what I wanted to show you. Um, he can also get really good pressure off of it as well if he goes for, um, if he decides to cancel into this, um, he gets really good pressure. Uh, the only way that the opponent can get out is by flawless blocking and that's the only option that they have. Um, but the thing is that you have to make sure that you manage to get the high out or you could just, you know, go for um, double mids. You know what I'm saying? Shit like that. But, uh, yeah, that's pretty much what I wanted to say. I think Johnny Cage has by far the strongest uh, fatal blow in the game. Um, he still needs buffs, but overall, he definitely has uh, the better fatal blow out of the game. Uh, he can literally use this to his advantage. Now, like I said, the downside of it is that you have to be, like, down to where the fatal blow is able to be available to you now if the opponent is very experienced and they understand that you are able to uh take advantage of that situation they're going to have to respect that option that you can do that now the other downfall of this is is that um it's difficult to do and also you have to predict that the opponent is going to use a string to where um it's going to be like there's going to be like a gap in it like jax's uh string you understand what I'm saying? So that's all I really had to say. Like, I think this is pretty interesting. Uh, you know, how he has like free armor basically. And the thing about it is, is that his fatal blow comes directly back. Um, does this need a nerf to a certain degree? Yeah, but it is really difficult to do and perfect because I'm still trying to practice uh, how to do this and stuff like that. Because I was thinking to myself, I was like, hmm, I wonder if Johnny Cage can get out of gaps or some kind of pressure when he does his uh, fatal blow. And he can. And uh, I didn't even notice that. You know what I'm saying? I thought I could get beat out every single time, but that's not the case. Not with Johnny Cage. So this is really scary because it also sets up um, his nut punch that he can get, which it turns into a crushing blow if the opponent gets punished and stuff. And that's kind of scary, you know what I'm saying? So, uh, yeah, Johnny Cage's uh, Fatal Blow is definitely, like, really good. Like, it's insanely good. They're gonna end up nerfing it, obviously, uh, to where, like, if he gets, like, some kind of combo on the opponent, you know, they're gonna allow that to be a thing, but, like, they're probably gonna take the armor off of this because, like, you can really abuse you can abuse this like a lot like i'm not even joking like you can you can abuse this lot like you poke and then you can easily like if you think the opponent's gonna poke you can easily do that and take advantage of the situation and go for like a mid and shit like that you know what i'm saying and get like free armor and then the opponent's gonna be like yo fuck this guy but like i said the downfall of this is is that you have to have less health but other than that yeah this is like a insanely good uh fatal blow like 
you know what I'm saying? I, I just thought I wanted to throw that out there and stuff like that. So let me know what you guys think in the comment section down below. I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace.